Hi guys, I um, want to show you a cool necklace that I got yesterday. I went to, we drove to Evangelina's. If you ever want to go to a cool store, find a lot of goth stuff, a lot of cool stuff, go to drive up to Old Sacramento if you can. They always give you these free magnets every year, which is so cool. It's the newest one. I bought just a couple things, but I'm going to show you what for instrument they have there for instance look at this hearse necklace I got that is kick-ass that's the kind of stuff I like and I also bought this geisha girl makeup it's by star blend um, it's really good quality makeup um, if you want to powder you know you want to go real real white say you want to go out clubbing or something like that or just go around the house for us goths and um, I just bought this you know it has a lot of skulls on it for work scrunchy I didn't buy too much. Uh, we were just out having fun, uh, going around, tasting ice cream. That was awesome. Um, we had a good time. A lot of people were out yesterday. I also got this cool feather for my hair. Feathers are in again. <laughs> That's what I hear. And then I got this. I love these things that go on my head. <laughs> anyway, what I wanted to talk about today uh, on a goth uh, note, um, gothy note, I, I get so tired of hearing people call everybody, you're a poser, you're a poser, you're a poser. Um, I think a lot of people, you know, uh, you know, know who they are. Don't, you know, you really shouldn't call anyone a poser, I guess, because I kind of feel bad. The only thing I don't like are people that I see that, like, at these twilight stuff that are all dressed up just for the evening, you know, trying to be goth, and it's so ridiculous. Um... But, you know, there's different types of goth, as, you know, what I asked you guys before, what type of goth are you, and I love all your responses, I love them. But what you guys ought to realize, you know, everyone has their own style, and no matter what, you know, there's other people giving a lot of advice on what to do, because I get a lot of questions, and I try to answer them all. What I always tell people not to do is don't go get tatted if you're not, not what you want. Like I said, i got a lot of tattoos, I showed you guys millions of times. I love Nightmare Before Christmas, my whole arm sleeved, and the other one's half done. And um, the whole thing about this uh, ordeal of being goth and tatted is that you can't take it off. And I've said that many times before. Um, and I just, you know, I feel bad when I see people out there, you know, they say, my mom won't let me wear black or whatever, you know, or do, you can just be who you are, like I always say, be yourself. But I hear people calling all these names and stuff, you know, they're just, I don't know, they're just, they're overdoing, you know, I think, you know, calling the name, calling with the goths. I, because we've all been picked on for being goths. Come on, guys. Let's not say we weren't. Everyone in some aspect or something have been picked on. And I think that we should tame down people who are trying to learn the culture or understand it. And there's a lot of people who do hate us. But let them hate. I don't I don't care. If you guys hate us, I was called a bloodsucker the other day because I went and seen uh, MJ's tomb. I don't care what you guys think. I love going to the cemeteries and especially Forest Lawn. It was awesome to go there and look around. And I'm going to do it again coming up shortly. And... Um, it's just something I like to do. I mean, I mean, and that isn't always a goth thing to go do that kind of stuff. But I think you guys should be a little bit more understanding with people who are trying to learn the culture. And, you know, give them credit. You know, they're trying. I mean, if that's what they want to do, let them be goth. I love the cult, goth subculture. It's interesting. I think it's awesome. You know, it has a lot of uh, cool people. A lot of artistic people. You know, just... I just, not all of us are suicidal, jobless, uneducated, I mean, and depressed. I'm not. I definitely am not depressed, not jobless, or suicidal. And I'm not a cutter. I listen to kick-ass music. I have a great life. I, I just, I just, I'm awesome. I think my life's awesome. You know, I just, I love how things are, you know. There's few things in life I wish could be a little bit better, you know. You know, it's just like a lot of cool shit, you know, and I just, I don't know, I'm just happy. So, just to say we be happy, smile at everybody today. Mm. Love all you guys. I want to hear your comments. I love reading, and I love all my new subs, and everybody out there. I just want to give a shout out to a few people. Uh, just a little look at Pumpkin. I love your, um, uh, you know, your comments, and I just think you're cool. 
and uh, Profound Tortures, one of my very, very favorite YouTubers. Um, and I also love some normal people out there. I want to say hi to Tushi Galore. You know I love you. She was my first person I ever watched on YouTube. And I love her I, I Am Not Goth video. I just want to tell you that girl cracked me up. I love it. Love you guys.